Chicago once lifted itself off the ground. In the 1850s and 1860s, relentless floods forced a radical fix. Engineers designed a new sewer system and decided to raise streets and buildings to meet it, instead of demolishing whole blocks. Crews slid rows of screw jacks under brick hotels, shops, and homes. Teams turned them in unison, a quarter turn at a time, guided carefully by foremen. Massive structures crept upward, sometimes more than six feet, while life continued inside. Guests slept in hotel rooms, clerks sold goods, and families ate dinner as their buildings rose slowly above mud. Spectators lined sidewalks to watch entire streets lift cleanly into the air, an uncanny sight of precision and nerve. Damage was very rare, thanks to careful planning and disciplined crews. The project delivered modern drainage and healthier streets, and room for a growing city to expand without drowning in its own water. Chicago did not just survive, it reinvented how a city could adapt to its terrain. Today it stands as one of the boldest urban engineering feats ever attempted, a proof that patience, math, and muscle can move a metropolis. This really happened. Subscribe for more wild history.